And Sheriff David Davis says an Uber driver is fortunate to be alive after he was shot while driving on Bloomfield Road. Coroner Leanne Jones says a bullet pierced the man's skull, but it didn't hit his brain. Now, the Boone County Sheriff's Office is investigating who shot the man. Ashlyn Webb spoke to the sheriff today. Ashlyn joins us in studio to tell us what he had to say. Yes, the question many have after hearing this news was the shooting targeted. It happened at 830 at night at a busy intersection when many people are still out. The sheriff says they're still investigating to try to answer that question. Meanwhile, people who can commute on the west side of town say this is concerning. We heard several gunshots. Jocelyn Dumas says she was at home watching a movie with her daughter last night when she heard at least six shots. She now believes those shots came from less than a mile away. Bibb County Sheriff's Office says an Uber driver was driving on Bloomfield Road at this intersection at Chamber Road when he was shot in the back of the head while driving. We don't know if they knew each other. We don't know if this may be a case of some type of road rage or or mistaken identity or, or, or something. Investigators say it started near a convenience store on Chambers Road where the Uber driver had just dropped off a ride. A turquoise Mazda M3 began following him. He says the Uber driver let the Mazda pass him, but then the Mazda slowed down, so the Uber driver went around him. Sort of a leapfrog in the situation where they were passing each other. Davis says at some point, someone in the Mazda fired shots at the Uber driver, shooting him in the back of the head. They still are investigating whether the shooting was random or targeted. I go that way to go to Walmart just to, you know, get food for my family. So it's, you know, you have the constant thought, am I a threat? Just the fact that this happened on a busy intersection, <clears throat> 830. I mean, a lot of people are still out then. What's your thoughts as sheriff on, on this? It's very disappointing, but it seems to be a trend that we're seeing of people that have uh, no conscience and no impulse control with a gun in their hands. Sheriff Davis says they're looking for a turquoise older model Mazda M3. Davis says the shooter is in his mid 20s, about five foot seven, black with shoulder length dreads. Frank Glory. Thank you, Ashlyn. If you have any information on the shooting, you can call the Bibb County Sheriff's Office at 478 751 7500.